Do they stay? What do they need to know about? This? Sorry, what was the question? For people who are just seeing the buzzer beaters and tuning in nationwide, what do they need to know about NC State and how you got in this game? Uh, I think you're going to see a team with a lot of heart, a lot of grit, and I think you're going to see a team that's able to win. And that's what we're going to do. And what were you What were you feeling there in the first half? Obviously, you were able to get 10 points. Felt like every single time you got the ball, you were able to back them down. I mean, what was working for you there in the first half in particular? Uh, absolutely, man. I got to give a lot of that credit to the guards. I mean, they were able to find me on some on some great pick and rolls, on some great dump offs and things like that. I mean, honestly, I mean, I just kind of felt like, I mean, I was, I was, as soon as I saw the ball go in, started feeling good, I knew I was going to try and keep going back at it. I mean, luckily with the guards, they were able to keep finding me, and I was able to put it in a couple times. I know you've already asked, been asked this, but I didn't get it on video. Your <laughs> thoughts on, uh, on on Michael O'Connell, that shot for him, that moment for him, obviously you guys have seen him go through, you know, offensive struggles at times this season, but, man, this, this tournament for him has really been on. Absolutely. No, my, I mean, he has been – amazing every single game. I mean, he's always been one of the best passers I've ever seen. I'm able to assist people like no other. But I mean, I mean, especially when that ball started going through the hoop for him these last couple of days, I mean, he's been playing a different level of basketball lately. I mean, especially with that shot, I mean, it's like a movie. I mean, but the, <laughs> I'm still seeing it going through my head every time I close my eyes, that shot going up, hitting backboard, and then going in, and then obviously going into overtime knowing we were about to win that game. After four days, how did you guys find enough juice in overtime to be able to, to close this thing out, too? Yeah, I mean, honestly, I mean, Again, people keep on talking about fatigue, but I don't really, I don't think we're feeling fatigue. I mean, it seems like every game we play, we get better, we get more energy, we get stronger, and I think we're going to keep doing that tomorrow.